All right, David. First off, aloha. Aloha. How's it feel to be home, man? Uh, it feels great. You know, um, it's nice getting back in the warm weather, uh, seeing friends and family that you know I, I normally don't get to see around this time of year. So uh, that's always nice. And uh, you know, seeing old training partners and uh, old coaches, it's it's a lot of fun. Do you ever um, even get to come home during the season at all? Uh, usually not. Usually I only come home during the summer. So uh, this is this is a nice uh, addition to our season, in my opinion. Coach Borshoff just told me the story about how you went to American University. You were an unsigned senior at Fargo. Yep. Uh, I had, I think I was signed just to go to like University of Hawaii. I wasn't going to wrestle, but uh, yeah, I met uh, Coach Kyle at Fargo, so. That's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was a really exciting time for me, so. And your brother Josh, was he, he's now with you at American. Yep. Russell yeah. in 33, you're 25. Uh -huh. um, are those some good scraps between you? Oh, yeah. Um, just the day before this, we, we had a good one in the room, so we're, we're training hard against each other. Does it turn into a fight much? Uh, occasionally. Um, I don't want to say too much, but, you know, we're brothers, so it happens. All right, I love the wide open style you have, man. You absolutely throw the kitchen sink. I love the double <laughs> overhooks, the step across, the reach. How you, you look out of position to you, but it's a lot of judo stuff. Yeah, yeah. Um, I grew up with judo uh, here, um, so that, that plays a lot into the way I wrestle. Uh, and, uh, you know, I just, you know, I figure I might as well try to do everything I can. And a lot of those things are throws and, you know, that kind of stuff. So it just, it just sort of comes out when I wrestle. Are we going to see anything special today in front of a home crowd here in Honolulu? Uh, hope so, yeah. I'm going to try and make something happen. How far away is home from here? Uh, only like 15 minutes, 20 minutes, maybe. So. It's, it's pretty close. When Teague told you this was going to happen, um, was this, were you guys, was your family a big role in trying to get this to happen here? Did they tell you when they were recruiting you this could potentially happen? When you heard about this, what was your thoughts? Uh, they, I had no idea when I was recruited that something like this would uh, eventually take place. Um, but uh, we, Teague was sort of mentioning it uh, last year, um, maybe in the middle of the season, around scuffle. Same, same time of year as uh, right now, but um, it was just a, you know, a, a kind of a thought back then. But uh, eventually when we hit, started hitting the summer, uh, it started looking like it was actually going to happen. And uh, of course, I, I was really excited for that. And, um, you know, my brother kind of lucked out. His first year at American, you know, he, he gets to come, come back and wrestle in front of a, a home crowd. So, uh, and, uh, my, you know, my parents, they've They've constantly been trying to spread the word, getting people to watch, and uh, um, so yeah, they, they've definitely helped out with uh, getting this to happen. Great competition for you last year at the Scuffle. I think you had like a crazy semifinal match with like Garrett or someone. Yeah, so it was crazy match. Um, you know, not getting quite the same competition. No Ronnie Bresser today, is what right, I'm hearing. Right. Um, and you might get you know a shot at Milhoff. Um, no Brand Kale. So, you know, it's kind of a situation yeah. today where we should see you roll. Um, you know, what do you want to get out of today? And, and you know, this, this, this what is it, a seven-day trip for you guys? Um, yeah, just about seven what, days. What do you want to get out of it? Well, I, at least uh, for the competition, I, you know, I just want to just want to showcase all, all the skills that um, I've been learning in the room uh, with Teague and all the other guys and uh, just show uh, some Hawaii people, you know, we can we can compete in the, at the national level if, uh, you know, we train hard and put our minds to it. So that's, that's what I want to do with the competition. And then... Uh, for uh, the rest of the days we're here, you know, I want to show the guys around, have them a good time while still getting some good training in. You know, it's going to be nice having, you know, a, you know, a good two-hour practice or three-hour practice maybe and then hitting the beach after, showing them that, you know, there's a lot of a lot of fun to do around here. So. Said you, is Travis Lee the only guy to ever wrestle an NCAA tournament for, for, from Hawaii? Um, no, we've, we've had, we have a couple guys. Travis Lee's the only one to have won it. Three-time um, champ. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah, Did you look up to a guy like that? Oh, yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, when I uh, started thinking about college wrestling, you know, I, I, I read up on Travis Lee and all the stuff he's done, and, you know, the guy's incredible. And uh, my brother was lucky enough to wrestle with him a little bit at a clinic, um, but I, I I've act I've actually haven't gotten to meet him uh, personally. It, it's interesting, though. Uh, we went to the same judo club, actually. Um, really? When we grew up here, yeah. yeah. And I might have like seen him when I was like a little kid or something like but that. But you didn't know? Yeah, I didn't know who he was. So, um, yeah, it's, I definitely looked up to him.
All right. Any crazy surfing on the North Shore, cliff oh, diving, not, not anything? Not for me. Not, not North Shore. Way too big. That's no joke <laughs> over there, man. Oh, man. The Those waves are, are huge. Big. We went there. It was amazing. Any cliff diving? Uh, perhaps. Perhaps? Um, nothing over like 20 feet or anything. All right. We didn't inspire you with that Minnesota video? Oh. <laughs> Did you uh, get maybe, to see that? Maybe we'll have to do it then. I don't know. <laughs> All right. You got anything else for me? Um, no. Aloha from Hawaii. <laughs> All right. Mahalo. Mahalo.